Download this code and get free GPT-40 from CodeGive.com, link in the description below. To add an auto increment constraint to an existing column in a MySQL table, you can use the alter table statement along with the modify keyword. This process allows you to modify the column to be auto incremented and set it as the primary key if needed. Here's a step-by-step -step tutorial along with a code example. Hashtag 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 tutorial, add an auto increment constraint to an existing column in MySQL. 1. Connect to your MySQL database asterisk. Use your preferred MySQL client to connect to your database where the table is located. 2. Identify the table and column asterisk. Make sure you know the name of the table and the column you want to modify to be auto-incremented. 3. Run the alter table statement asterisk. Use the following syntax to add the auto-increment constraint to the existing column. Table underscore name, the name of the table where the column is located. Column underscore name, the name of the column you want to modify. Data type, the data type of the column. If you also want the column to be the primary key, include primary key at the end of the statement. 4. Execute the SQL statement asterisk. Run the alter table statement in your MySQL client to apply the changes. Hashtag 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 code example. Suppose you have a table named users with an existing column ID that you want to make auto increment and the primary key. Here's how you can achieve that. After running the SQL statement in your MySQL client, the ID column in the users table will be auto-incremented and set as the primary key. Remember to always back up your data before making structural changes to your database tables.